new Mercedes X-Class arrives and the premium pickup is born. The new Mercedes X-Class pickup truck will go on sale late in 2017, dropping Mercedes right into the global mid-sized pickup market. Yes, Mercedes is building a pickup truck. It's called the Mercedes X-Class and it's due on sale in the UK towards the end of 2017. Mercedes confirmed all of the above at a reveal event for the X-Class in Stockholm, Sweden, where it unveiled not the final production model but a near production concept dubbed the Mercedes Concept X-Class. In fact, we've been treated to two distinct concept versions of the new truck that's being built on the robust ladder frame platform shared with the Nissan Navara and Renault Alaskan Pick UPS under Mercedes deal with the Renault Nissan Alliance. First, the Concept X-Class powerful adventurer is an off-road focused design that sets out to underline the fact that a truck carrying the three-pointed star will still be tough. Second, the Concept X-Class stylish explorer is intended to showcase the premium refinement that will set the Mercedes pickup apart from rough and ready rivals with less illustrious badges on the nose. Best pickup trucks on sale right now. The X-Class, Mercedes proudly claims, is the world's first premium pickup truck. None of the brands that the Stuttgart firm would count as direct premium rivals have yet ventured into the sector that is growing in the UK but is already a huge market around the world. Speaking at the reveal event, Chairman D.R. Dieter Zetsche said, with the Mercedes pickup, we will close one of the last gaps in our portfolio. Our target, we want to offer customers vehicles matching their specific needs. The X-Class will set new standards in a growing segment. The core attraction driving the pickup truck's growth, in Europe and other regions, is centered around its dual use as a passenger and working vehicle and Mercedes thinks it can pull off this mix better than most. The brand points out that it blazed the trail in the SUV segment with the M-Class in the early 90s before any other premium brand took the plunge with a road-biased sports utility model. And just look how that one turned out. Mercedes X-Class Concept Design In line with this dual recreational and commercial use at which pick UPS tend to excel, the Mercedes X-Class is a five-seater double cab model. The links to its Nissan Navara sister vehicle can be clearly seen in the profile but Mercedes has dropped in its familiar brand styling cues to make the model its own. The Strange History of Mercedes Pickup Trucks the Concept X-Class gets a bold front end, even by the standards of the never shy or retiring pickup class. The slim, high-mounted LED headlights give a sporty look that's a break from convention in the sector but the oversized grille with huge three-pointed star is very much the norm. Below, the Concept has a vast air intake that may well be toned down in production guise and a large power bulge in the center of the bonnet hinting at the potency that lies beneath. At the rear we would expect the unusual oval lighting arrangement that laps the entire tailgate to get the axe as this X-Class concept makes the transition to production car, replaced by more conventional LED light clusters, while the huge 22-inch wheels on the X-Class stylish Explorer might well be confined to the options list. The dramatically flared wheel arches are bespoke Mercedes styling additions that are likely to make the cut, however. Interior Design of the Mercedes X-Class Concept Where the Concept X-Class Stylish Explorer takes a more refined, even sporty, design approach, the Concept X-Class Powerful Adventurer is every inch your uncompromising off-road truck. Outside, Mercedes has slapped on some oversized tires and an electric winch while the tailgate is an unusual grid design. The interior gets robust brushed metal and carbon surfaces with black leather upholstery and accents that match the Lemonax yellow metallic paint outside. There's even a fire extinguisher strapped to the dash, just in case. It's a very different treatment from the wood finishes and cream leather of the Concept X-Class Stylish Explorer but both models get familiar Mercedes switchgear and technology with a freestanding tablet-like display at the heart of the dash. The truck's functions can be controlled via Mercedes' familiar touchpad interface that's a cut above the systems you'll find elsewhere in the pickup segment in terms of sophistication. There's even a built-in mobile SIM card that will allow owners to locate and check on their vehicle via a Mercedes app. 
The production version of the truck won't be quite as luxuriously appointed as the concepts but Mercedes insiders confirmed that materials and tech for high specification models will be lifted straight from the Mercedes passenger car range. X-Class derivatives lower down the range will get more of a commercial vehicle feel inside but Mercedes is confident that they will still be a cut above current pickup class standards. Mercedes X-Class chassis, engine, and safety. Details are a little scarce in the engines and powertrain area but we know that the production Mercedes X-Class will run on the ladder frame chassis from the Navara and use a 4MATIC permanent four-wheel drive system that has two locking differentials and a low-range gearbox. An alternative 4X4 system switchable between all-wheel drive and rear-wheel drive will also be available. We're told that the top-of-the-range X-Class model will get a Mercedes V6 diesel engine, a point of difference from the Nissan and Renault versions which also suggests that the 2.3-liter four-cylinder diesel from the Navarro will find its way into X-Class entry-level variants. The V6 diesel is expected to be the 3.0-liter unit from the Mercedes passenger car range with 261 bhp and 620 nm of torque. If so, that will make it comfortably the most potent UK market pickup. A four-cylinder petrol unit will also be available in some markets with manual and automatic gearboxes offered globally. When asked if there was a high-performance Mercedes AMG X-Class in the pipeline, Volker Mornheinweg, head of Mercedes vans was giving little away, so far no, but maybe we will see in the future he said. The payload for the X-Class is up to 1,200 kg, ensuring it easily qualifies for the favorable commercial vehicle tax classification in the UK, while a towing weight of 3,500 kg is competitive for the sector and adds to the truck's potential as a utility vehicle. Mercedes is also promising precise steering, a comfortable ride, and agile cornering, not things pickup trucks are necessarily no for. Even though the latest models are much improved over previous generation trucks, they still struggle to match equivalent large subs dynamically. It'll be interesting to see what Mercedes pulls off in this area but they are confident in the results they've archived. The rear suspension is the five-link independent setup from the Navarro but completely overhauled by Mercedes engineers in the quest for greater refinement. There's also a wider track for improved stability and higher cornering speeds. Van Boss Volker Mornheinweg told Auto Express, we know what has to be done to a she of driving capability and handling. I don't like the bouncy feel of a pickup I want a crisp steering feel and I think we have archived that. Safety wise, we can expect to see a range of advanced driver assistance systems. The Nissan Navara is already available with a good range of safety kit, including automatic emergency braking, EB, and a 360 degree reversing camera. These features are likely to find their way into the X-Class alongside a number of even more advanced systems from the Mercedes arsenal. Safety is one of the hallmarks of our brand says Mornheinweg you can expect the very highest standards from the production model. What's the market for the Mercedes X-Class? Mid-sized trucks like the Nissan Navara, Toyota Hilux, Mitsubishi L200 and Volkswagen Amarok might look positively big to us but only because Europe doesn't get the monsters like the Ford F150 and Dodge Ram, which constitute the 3.5-ton large pickup segment that's mainly focused in the US. The X-Class is a mid-sized effort like its Nissan Navara and Renault Alaskan sister vehicles and Mercedes says it's been targeted predominantly at the markets in Australia, South Africa, Brazil, Argentina, Europe, and Russia. To that end, Mercedes will build the X-Class both at the Nissan plant in Barcelona, Spain, and at Renault's facility in Córdoba, Argentina. Production is set to begin in Spain during 2017, ready for the European launch at the end of the year with the South America market truck rolling off the Renault line in 2018. The mid-sized pickup segment accounts for 14.1% of the Australian car market, 11.6% in Argentina and 5% in Brazil, while the current 0.5% and 1.3% shares in Germany and the UK are expanding steadily, so there's obvious appeal for a brand like Mercedes.
with Nissan currently the world's second biggest manufacturer of mid-sized pick UPS with 80 years experience in the segment, Mercedes clearly thinks it's chosen its partner wisely. In the UK, the X-Class will be sold exclusively through the brand's network of commercial vehicle dealerships and Mercedes is expecting its premium truck to have a big impact on what is Europe's biggest market for mid-sized pick UPS. On the one hand the X-Class will be looking to take a sizable share of a sector that was over 40,000 units in size last year. On the other, with a premium badge and pricing to reflect it, the truck has the potential to expand the pickup market, attracting customers who had been considering subs.